Hey guys, Dr. Five here with another episode of our Atletico Madrid career mode on FIFA 20. We're kicking this episode off. We're taking on Valencia at home in the Wanda Metropolitano Stadium. Let's go over the lineups. Let's see how this one is going to turn out. So our lineup is Oblak in goal. Our back line of Lodi, Chiellini, Hermoso and Matteo. Party is at CDM. Saul and Koke is the two centre midfielders. Coutinho is back in at Cam with Jota and Felix as our two strikers. As for the opposition, Valencia are playing a 4-4-2, Silva in goal, Tierney, Aldevrod, Joe Gomez and Sash as a back four, so one of our former players, Cherishev, Parejo, Marino and Pizzi as the midfield four, and up top is Poulsen and Rafael Leal. It's going to be a tough one though, another, another big team who are kind of along with us going for the Champions League. Ah. Get up. 20 yards out, Pareo. Pizzi's come across as well. Pareo strikes it into the back of the net. Nine minutes in, we are once again 1 0 down. It's a silly free kick to give away. We shouldn't be giving away free kicks like that anyway. Win that. Get it out. Get it out, Saul. Coutinho into the open net. First shot well saved by Sillison. But he's there to tap home the rebound. A nice through ball as well. A little lot, a little kind of dinked little through ball off the ground over the defender's legs. I think it was Koke as well. Yeah, Koke. Little dinked ball. First time shot well saved. Second one fell right back to him. And he's in the perfect place at the perfect time. Back on level terms. Let's not concede again now. It's one good thing about this, this Atleti squad. Some of the passing we've made has been incredible. Oh, Parejo, the goal scorer, holding off Vigel Felix very nicely there. Saul! Lovely dribbling. Nice, nice effort to go for the shot, but unfortunately it didn't quite work out. Skips fast one. Cuts it back to Coutinho. He's going to cut back inside. Strikes it. Cross goal. Well saved. Felix can't get to the rebound. That's a wonderful touch. Just got to strike it across goal. Wonderful touch to help Joel Felix into the perfect position there to just strike it across goal. Really, really good touch to get past Joe Gomez there. Look at that. Just drags it away. Joe Gomez had already gone in for the tackle and we just got away from him. Lovely finish past Sillison as well. And just like that, we flip the game on its head. Rafael. Leal. Loses up to Saul. Can also do the defensive work. The thing about Thomas Partey is he can do the attacking work just as well as he can defensively. Saul, not the best pass there. I will, will, will say that. Look at the space. Oh, João Felix just couldn't hold off Joe Gomez. Maybe it would have been a foul if he'd went down there. Not quite sure. This this guy. That was just incredible by Saul. The two old guards in the midfield, Koke and Saul, working together to make it 3-1. Incredible. Absolutely incredible. Take a look at this dribbling. Just cuts back outside, drags it across, right on the penalty spot. Koke, first time finish. Unmarked in the box, because they've all run over to Sal to try and stop him. Maffeo comes across. Flicks. They want to get back into this one now. Great strike, great goal. I think that was his first strike on goal after just coming on for Rafael Leal. Kind of unexpected. Kind of caught all black off guard there. Yeah, look at that. Nice turn as well. Really nice turn into the strike. And then just bang. Levers it. All black almost got to it. I won't fault him for that. Just trying to find a bit of space, you know. Don't want to waste any. Oh, what a pass. And we keep going. Through to Saul. Stops. Cuts inside. Strikes it. 
And he finishes it as well. Saul is on the brace. He is loving life against Valencia here today. Captain Fantastic. This defence just does not know how to stop him with that dribbling. Look at Drew Gomez. Sent him to the shops. Bang. Strikes it in. We got taken out anyway, so that would have been a penalty. Oh. Oh, great strike. Parejo's on the double as well. The midfielders are scoring loads of goals today. Unmarked. They just broke down our defence very, very well there. And our whole defence just kind of capitulated. Yusuf Paulson's come all the way back there. Pulling on the shirt. Cuts it across. No one's there. Paulson's not up for any attack though. But somehow they've broke through. Chiellini can he keep up with Guedes. We need the old guard to just silence the new boys and he has for the time being. They've got to get the ball upfield as quickly as they can. Hermoso just head this one away. There we go. Three points to Atletico Madrid. A very, very good game. A very entertaining game. But we do pick up all three points after going 1-0 down. We fought back and we held on to our lead. Brilliant game by the midfield. Saul and Koke. Xiao Felix got a goal for himself as well, but definitely say Saul had the best performance on the pitch today. Koke got a 9.3, Coutinho got a 9.3, and so did Saul. So the three midfielders. All of them got one goal. Koke got two assists. Saul got one assist. Koke didn't realise he had two assists. Koke then. Yeah, Saul and Koke though, the old guard. Very well in that game. Right, we're back for the second and final game of the episode. We're taking on Granada at the Stadio Classico. Match day number 10. We're sitting in fourth in the league table. Let's go over the squad lineups and let's literally get right into this game. Okay, so for them, they are playing 4 2 3 1. They've got Silver in goal. A backline of Amavi, Duarte, Restos, and Diaz. Azi and Seri is the two DMs. An attacking midfield three of Adnan, Hartel, and Puertas. And the lone striker is Tutinho. As for ourselves, a slight change up in the lineup. We've got Obak in goal. A back line of Lodi, Hermoso, Walker at centre back with Maffeo at right back. Party at CDM. Koke and Saul as the two centre midfielders. Coutinho back in at Cam and that Portuguese dynamic duo up top of Jota and Felix. Look at this. We have not. Oh, this is this is sup supreme. Ah, oh. nicely done, Maffeo. Space to run into as well, and he's just going to charge into it. Look at the pace on the lad. Oh, that's a great header by Zhao, but he's offside. Only just, really. Sure. Oh, no, a bit further than I thought. Lovely header, though. You don't want that man dribbling at you, Saul. Over the top, Zhao. Great save, Rui Silva. Nice save, really nice save. There's the cross. Jota, one touch. And then curls it. Ah, oh, blocked by like three players there. Jota. Great save again by Rui Silva. Coutinho. Edge of the box. Jota first time. Silva again with the save. Back across, punched away. Coutinho is going to take it down. Over one player's head. Walker's on it. Walker finds Jota. Jota finds Coutinho. In the box, dribbles, scores. No, Silva makes the save. Saved again. Crazy. Keeps having a game of his life. Koke's found a bit of space. Back across. First time. Blocked. Half time. I have no idea how it's still 0 0. Eight shots, seven on target. Keeper's made six saves. Hopefully, we can find the back of the net in this half. Short to Coutinho. Pulled back to Jota. Blocked. Walker can't win the header. Jota takes it down. Perfect touch. Dribbles. Oh. Referee, I'm on the attack. That was so annoying, that game. 
And they literally sat back. They're at home. They're the home team. They got completely dominated. Mental. Really good performance by that goalkeeper. They didn't have a single shot on target. Anyway, it's been a pretty entertaining episode. High action and the goals to show for it game against Valencia. And then this one was just high action, but no goals to show for it. But anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, please like, subscribe, and peace. See you in the next one.